Hello, I'm Brad Becker. We're glad to have you with us for Red Barn Radio's Appalachian Winter Solstice Program. We are joined by three Eastern Kentucky families deeply connected by the music they play together. The magic of music shines bright during the holiday season. We hope the music you hear today will bring comfort and connection to you and your family. The program features the Miller family, the Parsons family, and the Wells family. Hello folks, we're gonna play some music just like we would at home during the holidays. I'm Jesse Wells, this is my sister Carrie Carter and her husband Matt Carter on the guitar. And uh, we're gonna play some fiddle tunes and music that we play with our, the rest of our extended family during this time. And really excited to share some of these tunes. The first tune's gonna be Christmas Eve, a tune that comes from Western Kentucky from Jim Bowles, a wonderful old fiddler. Um, he learned this from an older fiddler. He said he, this was the only tune he played. He loved the, the joy of this tune so much, and it was the only tune he knew how to play. <laughs> and it's all year long. All, <laughs> Christmas Eve.
Welcome to Arts Place in Lexington, Kentucky. Arts Place is the home of LexArts and provides space and resources for creativity and learning in our vibrant local arts community. LexArts is the premier cultural, development, arts advocacy, and fundraising organization helping to enhance the quality of life right here in Central Kentucky. LexArts is so very proud and honored to partner with Red Barn Radio to bring exceptional music performances direct from Kentucky to thousands and thousands of people across the world, and of course right here in Kentucky. Thank you for joining us today and enjoy today's performance to bring joy and happiness to your holidays. Red Barn Radio is presented with the financial support of Visit Lex, Lexington, Kentucky's Convention and Visitors Bureau. Planning to visit Lexington or just looking for more information? Visit Lex is on the web at visitlex.com. Lex Arts, Lexington, Kentucky's premier cultural development, advocacy, and fundraising organization. Lex Arts, working for the development of a strong and vibrant arts community as a means of enhancing the quality of life in Central Kentucky. And we thank Joseph and Shannon Hillenmeyer and the Hillenmeyer Christmas Shop for the live trees and accessories on our holiday stage tonight. The Hillenmeyer Christmas Shop is your destination for the best in decorations for the season. They are on Facebook and the web at hillenmeyerchristmas.com. This next song is written by this, our patriarch here, Will Parsons, um, and it's a song that's very spiritual to our family because we all farm together and um, we're learning how to um, live off the land as much as we can and survive. And it's really a song about that um, called Cradle of Rest. One, two, three, one. <laughs>
I've got no need to fear death. So make me a cradle of breath. When it's my time to lay down this soul. Another holiday theme, uh, the tune that comes from Doc Roberts, uh, Fiddle and Doc Roberts from uh, just down the road near Richmond, Kentucky. He and his family played a lot of music together, and um, this is a tune called The Deer Walk.
love traditional music. And uh, so we play uh, a lot of traditional music from the area where we're from because we live in a rich area in northeastern Kentucky, fiddle music. Uh, Roger Cooper, the great Lewis County fiddler, has been an influence on myself and, and all of these guys. We play a bunch of tunes that he taught us that Buddy Thomas played. Uh, we play a bunch of Ed Haley tunes. My parents used to watch him play on the streets when they were young, watching uh, Ed Haley play on the streets. Uh, Blind Bill Day was another great fiddler from Ashland. So we play a lot of the tunes, uh, the regional tunes from our area. Uh, but we also like uh, Irish music. And we have just a little bit of Irish, a little bit of Scottish in our ancestry. So uh, we're going to do a favorite um, Christmas song about some wise guys. No, I mean wise men. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to do, um, so this is uh, Scott Miller and the Wise Guys and Sarah <laughs> So uh, we're going to do, uh, do that, and then we're going to go into an Irish tune that we always enjoy playing called Swallowtail Jig.
It's been a big part of our family for many generations, and um, fortunate enough to learn to play this instrument from our Carrie and I's father, uh, Jamie Wells, and um, his brother Robbie Wells, and Uncle Dave, and Aunt Beth, and <laughs> so many of our family play fiddles, or violas, or piano, or um, my wife and daughter love to sing, and you can tell that we we haven't quite taken up that uh, part of the musical tradition yet, but um, we love to make the fiddles sing, so we'll play this old Stamper family tune um, called Chinkapin Hunting, and um, good time of year to hunt chinkapins. <laughs> want to learn more about that, check out Google. <laughs> the old Chinkapin Hunting from uh, Fiddle and Art Stamper. Thank you. 
Uh, so I'd like to, you know, get to introduce everybody up here. It's my honor and privilege and burden to do most or all of the talking. Um, so I'll just introduce everyone really quickly. Over here on the far right, or my far right, um, playing mandolin, doing a little bit of singing and a whole lot of songwriting, is my brother Billy Parsons. Um, directly next to him is my beautiful wife, Anuette. Parsons now, Sunland before. Um, then to my left immediately is Megan Gregory. And then next to her, my father, Will Parsons. And now that all of them have been introduced, I'd like to sing another song that I wrote. Uh, this song is called Nevada Christmas. And uh, I know that people from Nevada call it Nevada, but uh, Nevada just has such a nice sound. Mm -hmm.
There's three old men walking around down there. I think they might be us. There's three old men walking around down there. And I think they might be us. Cowan Creek's a lot like our music family, <laughs> Kentucky music family, and um, we'll send this out uh, for Jimmy McCowan and yes. his memory, the wonderful fiddler, banjo player, guitar player, musician, um, had a family band in the 70s and 80s that toured quite a bit called the Outdoor Plumbing Company, <laughs> and uh, just a, a great example of family music. Um, in the hills of Kentucky and, and the traditions that are still happening. So that's right. Him and his wife Ada, Ada McCown. Yeah, Ada. Yeah, we'll send this out yes. to the McCowan. <laughs> cat tribe. We love cats, so <laughs> we always think of that this time of year. You know, Go cats. <laughs> <laughs>
very fortunate to have grown up in a house uh, full of music, uh, especially during the holidays with our family getting together and very lucky to have a dad that plays the fiddle and our mom played the guitar, or plays the guitar and um, we still play a lot of music when we get together and um, this next tune, I, I probably heard dad play this first and comes from one of our favorite fiddlers named Buddy Thomas um, from Lewis County, Kentucky and he and his sister uh, made a wonderful record called Kitty Puss, so another cat theme. Um, this is a tune called Turkey Gobbler, and we always think of turkey and good food at home during this time of the year and during the holidays. So a Buddy Thomas tune featuring Carrie Jean here.
From all of us at Red Barn Radio, to all of you, we wish you the happiest of holidays and our prayer for peace. Merry Christmas. Thank you.